HyFlex classroom at every PPCC campus is set up the same with the following devices, a camera in the back of the classroom, a confidence monitor, and a speaker microphone that's located under the whiteboard. There are three different ways to set up your HyFlex classroom using either the technology in the classroom or additional devices. The first is the fixed setup, the second is the mobile setup, and the third is a combination of the two. In the fixed classroom setup, you use all of the equipment that is already built into the classroom, which means the camera, the speaker microphone, confidence monitor, and projector. The pros of the setup is that you don't need any additional technology, students can see and hear you via your Zoom or WebEx session, and students in the classroom can see students in the Zoom or WebEx session on the projector screen. The cons of the setup, students in the Zoom WebEx session cannot see everyone that is in the classroom, and everything that is done on the classroom computer makes it a little difficult because you don't have a side-by-side -side view. Instead, everything's just done on that one monitor, which can get a little messy. However, with the fixed classroom setup, you can fully teach your HyFlex class and you don't have to bring any additional technology. In the mobile classroom setup, you would use the Swivel device. The Swivel is a little robot that sits on a stand and using an iPad or other tablet will follow you as you lecture. The device comes with a marker. The marker is actually a microphone that captures your voice and tells the Swivel robot which way to move. The nice thing about the mobile setup is that you have more options in showing students in the classroom. You also have more freedom to move around. With the classroom camera, it's fixed in one position, which means you can't have as much movement as you might want. With the swivel, however, you can move around the classroom. Students can also move during presentations or speeches. The pros here are that students can see one another if you pass the microphone around the classroom. You've got that freedom of movement. It's easy to set up in any classroom. You don't have to have the fixed technology. And running a Zoom or WebEx session from the iPad or a tablet on the swivel is easy to do. However, students cannot see one another at all times. The equipment does have to be carried to class, which can be cumbersome at times. And you have to remember to charge that iPad and that swivel. The third setup is the combination of both the fixed and mobile. In the combined setup, you use the equipment that's in the classroom as well as the swivel and perhaps an additional device to teach your course. This means that the Zoom or WebEx session is run from both the classroom computer and the swivel iPad. The swivel can show students in the classroom while the camera at the back of the classroom shows you while you are teaching. Students can use the swivel during presentations while also seeing their classmates on the confidence monitor. The swivel can serve as another breakout room for group activities while you remain in the main session on the classroom computer. The pros of the combined setup are that students can see one another, which helps to build classroom community. It's easy to set up in any classroom. Running a Zoom or WebEx session from the iPad or tablet on the swivel is easy to do and helps students to see one another. It gives you another connection to that web conference software. You are also able to cast your slides from the iPad, which means you can use a side-by-side -side view of WebEx or Zoom in the classroom. The cons of the combined setup are that it does take a little longer to set up at the beginning of class. Over the course of the semester, this gets easier and smoother. The equipment must be carried to class, which again can be a little bit cumbersome. And also, you have to get used to muting devices and turning them down. It can be a little tricky. The great thing about the fix, the mobile, or the combined setup is that you can teach your HyFlex course with any of these. If the HyFlex technology in your classroom is not working for any reason, you can teach your class entirely from the swivel device. Running a combination of the fixed and mobile setups in your HyFlex classroom means you have more options in how you display lecture slides, run class activities, and build classroom community. Whether you use the fixed, mobile, or combined classroom setup, you still have several tools that you can use to help build classroom community, including that side-by-side -side view available in WebEx and Zoom, the gallery view so students can see one another, the chat feature, polls, breakout rooms, you can develop speaking orders easily, and it's easy to run icebreakers. At 
any time. If you need support with your technology in your HyFlex classroom, you have both the remote slash HyFlex coordinator that you can reach out to at remote.instruction at ppcc.edu, as well as IT who could be reached at 4800 while in the classroom.